Okay, so for plaster of Paris, we use two parts plaster to one part water. Yeah, we'll just do it that way. That's just regular plaster? Regular plaster of Paris you can get it at Home Depot, whoop, I mean a hardware store, <laughs> <laughs> or a craft store. Two parts plaster, one part water. Two parts plaster, one part water. By volume. Okay. And uh, you don't need to wear, do you need to wear safety anything for no. this? No. Um, plaster is pretty, if you were breathing, it, like if you were mixing up a 50 pound container, I would wear, yeah, I would wear, definitely wear a dust mask. Is this at a, a good consistency right here? It is. Here? Okay. It is, but we should probably get it in the mold before it sets up too much. Okay. okay. Would silicone molds uh, work for the plaster yes. of Paris yes, as well? Yes, yes, absolutely. And silicone molds are very easy to find. In fact, um, not quite enough on that one. Um, the kind for fondant, for frosting, work fantastic for this. Would that be the candy molds? Yes, those also. Instead of the latex? Yes. So the advantage of the latex is just that you can make your own shapes. But if you, know, if, if you wanted to, I frequently use commercial molds as well. Hey, Curious Mondo fans, thank you for checking out our YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Also, check out the other videos in the channel for some fabulous tips, techniques, and interviews with artists.